If the regulator approves the modifications, Royal Mail may be permitted to stop delivering second-class letters on Saturdays. Ofcom is also looking at the possibility of allowing second-class delivery on other weekdays, which might help Royal Mail save money. The Universal Service Obligation, USO, which mandates that Royal Mail deliver packages five days a week and letters six days a week, has been examined by the regulator. For years, the volume of items sent by the post has increased, but the number of letters written has been continuously declining, costing Royal Mail millions of pounds in losses. According to Royal Mail, the company might save £300 million annually if it were to change its performance targets and reform second-class services. The Universal Service does need to change, according to Lindsay Fussell, Group Director for Networks and Communications at Ofcom, who made this statement on the BBC's Today Show. To be clear, she stated that there isn't really a choice because if there is, it won't be sustainable and everyone will have to pay much more for it. International Distribution Services, IDS, the company that owns Royal Mail, declared that change cannot come soon enough.